morning dear listeners and viewers on our top stories today real life superheroes emerge from the blue following the heroic rescue of 20 people by lifeguards of the Sima beach hotel limbe who spotted a capsizing boat at sea near the bakingili village the lifeguards immediately jumped into action saving lives and saving the day also in this edition of the news we shall focus on preparatory activities surrounding the upcoming 2025 presidential municipal and legislative elections as the Cameroon People's Democratic Movement political party, CPD and FACO 1A section members, sharpen their swords and prepare their shields for battle. Plus, the Southwest Development Authority, SOEDA, continues to seek ways on improving the living conditions of farmers in the region. These are our headlines and the news shall be yours in the Jiffy. Good morning again, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the morning news on a Cam One radio. The frequency is 99.5 FM, and this is the People's Radio. Breaking news from Boya following a fatal accident which occurred this morning at about 7 a.m. involving a private vehicle which lost control and collided with a tricycle transporting tomatoes. Two people have been confirmed dead, while three others are in critical condition in the hospital in Boya. The accident occurred around the great supermarkets uh, close to the Opportunity Industrialization Center, OIC in Boya. Our reporter in Boya will be giving us updates as the day unfolds in that part of the country. Okay, today this morning, as I woke up, as I recount that, this accident just occurred immediately from my phone. The motor, the private car where you can meet people them, if they come up or go to the car will be there down in the park. Or down there, in the park, where you want the unlock to match. This man, already motor, he come out outside, he cross roads, he can jam that keke. As he jam the keke, he start to carry people them. Start to carry people them up, so they can hit for that street and start to hit them. So presently, four people there hospital, where they're under acute, uh, and the drivers, three people will be inside the car, inside the motor, and the driver will get pulled over with. So presently, about seven people that day hospital, general hospital, presently, as we like, see the body that we did for this week. Now while they try to move the body, for carry as constant or income, we thank God. So, now the two way happened now, presently. 19 adults and one child were rescued by lifeguards of the Simbe Beach Hotel in Limbe, who spotted a boat almost capsizing near the Bakingili village. The lifeguards immediately jumped into action, rescuing 20 lives which were almost lost at sea. A heroic act which was saluted by the inhabitants of Bakingili village and the Simbe Beach authorities, who also praised the competence of their staff. Now take a listen to one of the lifeguards by the name of uh, Mr. Tameta Stefan, who recounts the story. Okay. Um, me now, Mr. Talmita Stefan, Chief of Dava of Oseme. I want just to, to tell all Limbe people about the, about the accident for water. Because yesterday, around 8 o'clock, we get, we get some problem on our beach. We some boat. Don't get problem. The water will enter inside the boat. It will be shout. Uh, uh, a security man can call me, come for full time, say, Well, chief, come for beach, come for hotel, so because some problem there for beach, but I need to see people, but I hear the noise. I would like a raft for the, for the beach. We understand, we we'll see and see the people inside water will shout. I would like to the point touch, we we'll see how we see them, but we're touching the reach for that place the day. I will want for the driver, for the boat camp, that is swim camp for sure. Come into the terminal and say, uh, we did so, we get problem for boat. We are both on brook on top water, the water they enter the. I will ask the same. When I didn't know how many, if they shock in the feet talk, they tell me say they did plenty. I will tell me so one small picking the day. I will just say small picking the day, say yes. That year that picking, I will just okay. I will have to take safety, tire, and I will go for. Short for, for inside water, for go move the picking. I wish for dinner. I tell them, I miss him, give me the picking man, swim away for bring it down. So that after now, if we can't take them, I will give me the picking, I swim away, bring it for down. I wish now for down, I drop it. I tell now the all up colleague and say, 
plenty of people they did for that boat. They will be able to do everything for go move them. They will be able to army them, Kopako army, where they did them too. We will thank them because they helped me a lot for that, for that situation yesterday. They will now go to go move first man, bring him for sure. Second man, bring for sure. Mr. Sepp, I don't have a for the for the swimming because we we'll go and come. I don't have a tire. I'll that just okay. We'll try to we'll see how we move the all. That was our agenda come from my head. How did we get did we get cheap? Tire cheap. I will say as I will we'll say we'll tie the tire then, make some seco. We we'll tie on rope, tie on rope, tie on seco, make seco. We start telling now any man they enter for cheap, any man they climb for cheap, any man they climb around for cheap. So they all them now, the way they are cheap. We we'll swim with them now, they bring them now for, for down. You got to be tell them, say, any time oh, I get rope for draw for pull front, they will pull the hand, they will pull the hand, that's how they make and so they come out for the seaside. After that, now, <coughs> if you remain both now, we'll come to the inside, inside water. I go meet her now, swim that back, go meet her that way, I tell the driver, I say, but now, go do it now. He said, I'll tell you, that is that you one cup. I'll lose one cup. I'll lose one cup. I'll lose one cup. I'll lose one cup. I'll tell you, I'll lose one cup. I jump down for water. I tell you, say, as if I say, he put the start. He say yes, he put the start. He start the boat. I tell him, just small, small, they come down. One time we had to had to swim to go in the jab. They come down with my back, small, small. Now we didn't have some lucky. Our water come, carry jump the boat. Lucky we not turn the boat. Lucky the our not turn the boat. He just jump the boat. The boat now, the boat now, uh, 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 take speed now, come for the shore. A lucky say, I see how way the boat they come because that boat come. The boat is jammed too, but I say I, I swim now go under the boat pass. I follow now for back. I will now boat now can land for beach. All car crew, no not no loss, no man no loss, no man no drink water, all man be there fine. I will now we take the now go for our restaurant side to Seme, give them coffee, but the skin warm so much because rain before a water, now this is the rain before night, for that kind of time, water be cold. I will now I call my manager that is okay. I used to see Sunday now, day for the place. Now, <clears throat> my name is okay, no problem, no day. See the fish sleep for day. Morning time now, because we wish for day now, we call Janda people, they call all uh, Janda, I mean, they be there, they will call all force, they may they come, they can't check them, all man, all man be there, fine, though. They will be there now, Janda people, they just tell you, no, the fish sleep for here. Morning time, where all man get a the, the book, all man get a ID card, no. the fish sleep for here, morning time now, they go. So they make before now, all man go now for morning time. I want just advice, my brother. Then I just beg you now. Oh, now we don't corner water. White people. I beg government, tie water bath. Men don't leave boat, me they enter water. Tie water rough. Men don't leave boat, me they enter water. Anytime when I water rough, when I leave boat enter water, I don't say. After people they go die inside water, we are not fine. We will feed, stop that kind of thing. We will stop that kind of thing. And the second thing, tell people they come out a boat for go Nigeria, go this way, this place. May they wear a life jacket. May they wear a life jacket. May they get a protection. Because yesterday I appreciate because that all time they begin that trip. See they begin that trip. We no go save no man for that for that. No go save no man. And no man no go come out. Look, you they begin that trip. I just beg you now. Say all time we put the one go. Go travel, the one go Nigeria, may they wear that, may they wear that life jacket. And I think they will save them for that. That will save them for that. And the second thing I'll say, many people, they do work out, many people, they do, 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 so army boat the fish here, they, they, they come cross for that. When I do when I work on whistle, because whistle is very, very important. That because they be there, they be there, they be there far away. They're not shouting, they be the shout. But other would hear. Say they be there far away. We don't hear that shouting. But say they be get that whistle. They go blow whistle, they go hear that whistle. Say, hey, that was the command of our side. More travel see the play with the whistle come on. I advise on I beg. You. I stop. I mean, I stop for taking risks for water side. We want to stop to, to die for water. We want to make prevention for ourselves. I don't beg on I don't beg government to for that, for that point.
That was Mr. Tameta Stefan, Chief Lifeguard at the Seme Beach Hotel Limbe and a real lifetime superhero. A meeting has been scheduled on the 31st of July 2024 in Memphis Central by the Divisional Officer for Aquaya Mbwa Augustine Ewe, who wants to seek a lasting solution to the frequent confrontations between the Otili and Oivie clans in Aquaya subdivision of Manu Division. All traditional rulers and elites of the warring clans are expected to attend the meeting as well as the clergy and the executives of the Aquaya Traditional Rulers Association. The National Autonomous Sinking Fund has statistics which reveal that as of April 25, 2024, the Cameroon government owes investors more than 3,663 billion francs CFA. In the first quarter of 2024, the debt contracted by Cameroon on, uh, on the CEMAC security market between January and March 2024 reached 1,865 billion francs CFA in the first quarter of 2024. According to the International Monetary Fund, which recently conducted an evaluation as part of its operations with the Cameroonian government, the IMF reports that inflation has fallen to 5.9% as at the end of 2023 and is expected to continue declining to 5.5% by the end of this year. On the other hand, the country's uh, internal debt is projected by 39% of the gross domestic product in 2024 with a gradual reduction planned to 34.1%. Ever since its inception, the Southwest Development Authority, in its acronym SOEDA, has been working to raise the standards of living of the rural population through agriculture, ensuring adequate food security and improving on the livelihood of the rural population in the region, as the Director General of SWEDA, Dr. Bisong Ogok Tui, tells us in the following excerpt. Weather has been working with the farmers of the region, ensuring that farmers have access to good quality planting material. Training farmers are making sure they have access to agricultural inputs at very competitive prices. Farm to market roads are given a facelift. Most of them have been in a sorry state for, for the last few years and uh, presently we are involved in rehabilitating some roads. We have been able to distribute over 300 motorized cassava graters to women groups and screw presses as well. This enables the women now to process the cassava without necessarily having to grind it by hand. We are in the process of putting in place 200 small cassava process permanent units and we are also building building two semi-industrial oil pump processing units, two semi-industrial cocoa processing units. All of this is mechanization. And that was uh, Dr. Tui Bisong Ogok, uh, Director General of uh, SOEDA, the Southwest Development Authority in Boyam. For a period of one month, over 100 students in the Boyam municipality will engage in cleanup activities while uh, receiving intensive moral education which falls within the framework of this year's Boya Council holding job programs, which was launched yesterday aimed at uh, equally uh, assisting the young people uh, financially. The mayor of Boya, uh, David Mafani Nabange, explains the concept of this win-win situation in the following excerpt. It's a win-win issue because they will assist us in keeping the municipality clean while we assist them and their parents to make sure that their return to school next academic year is lightened by the assistance that they will receive from us financially. Mayor David Manfani Nabange speaking there. We talk politics in this edition of the news. The Cameroon People's Democratic uh, uh, Political Party CPD and FACO 1A section members converged at the council hall in Down Beach Limbe to galvanize and encourage youths to register for the upcoming elections. And the event was celebrated under the theme Be Counted in the Voters' Registrars as Ngole Silver files in details. The Cameroon People's Democratic Movement, the CPDM, FACO 1A section, Central 2 subsection conference under the theme Be Counted in the re Voters' Registrar took place Friday, July 12, 2024 at the Council Hall Down Beach Limbe in the presence of the FACO 1A section president Ludwig Makaka, 
Posimboe Florence, who represented the Member of Parliament for Fako East constituency, President of the Central Two Subsection, Mr. Kombi, other personalities, amongst others. The conference brought together supporters and sympathizers of the party as they were encouraged to register in order to take part in the upcoming elections in Cameroon before 2025. Meanwhile, the supporters and sympathizers on their part gave out some challenges such as super bone water, amongst others. The conference is, is to put in place various aspects that will help us for the upcoming elections. We need to know about our militants, those who have registered, those who have not yet registered. Because it is through this conference that we are going to get the statistics about the registration at electoral office. Because if we just sit like that and we assume that all is well, we might be embarrassed on that day that even those doyens have not yet registered. So when we have a conference like this, we are sure that we are going to face our opponents with all confidence. So, as I earlier said, this is the ninth subsession that I'm attending, and I just feel that we are on a good foot. Now, well, if you look conference, to me, the first objective is to make sure we have all our militants and executives registered in the voters registration register and to make sure we have more militants, sympathizers, well wishers to prepare for the forthcoming elections. And secondly, I think we are here to mobilize and drum our support behind our natural candidate, His Excellency Mobia. So what we are having a substitute conference is to make sure we try to go according to the provisions of the text, make sure we have our militants registered, and make sure we give our natural president the 100% vote come 2025 elections. I'm very happy because I have found a way forward address the internal ranking that are happening within Fakuma area. Do that there are internal rankings within Fakuma area section. And this is a good way to find lasting solutions. And I'm, I'm happy that all the stakeholders who are here today agree with me that what we have proposed and resolution can go a long way to arrest those, language, those internal rankings. It was characterized with the reading of motion of support to the head of state, His Excellency President Paul Bia, handing off a party book containing the party text and also some financial support. It should be noted that the supporters and sympathizers of the CPDM have been called upon to register before the deadline come August 31st, 2024. Gordon Silver reporting them. Now on to international page. The body found on Spanish island of Tenerife has officially been identified as that of missing British teenager Jay Slater. A Spanish court has reported the autopsy confirmed that the death was due to trauma compatible with a fall in a rocky area. Donald Trump stole the show at the Republican National Convention with his appearance as the crowd chanted fight. It was a memorable moment to mark his official nomination. Meantime, Joe Biden, President Joe Biden, defended himself against criticisms over his rhetoric, which has been put in the spotlight in the aftermath of the assassination attempt of former President Donald Trump, but said it was a mistake to say it was time to put Trump in a bull's eye. In the 48 hours before he opened fire on the former President Donald Trump, 20-year-old Thomas Matthew Crooks uh, made a series of stops in and around his suburban Pittsburgh hometown. On Friday, he went to a shooting range where he was uh, a member and practiced a firing, a law enforcement official said. 
The next morning, Crooks went to a home depot where he bought a five-foot ladder and a gun store at a gun store uh, where he purchased 50 rounds of ammunition, as the official also said. Six people, including two Vietnamese Americans, have been found dead inside a luxury hotel room in central Bangkok with Thai police exploring the possibility that they were poisoned. The bodies were discovered by staff in a fifth in the fifth floor room at the Grand Hyatt Hotel after the guests missed checkout time by more than 24 hours, according to Tithi uh, Singawang, Bangkok's Metropolitan Police Commissioner. Robert F. Kennedy Jr.'s uh, son uh, Bobby Kennedy III posted a video of a phone call between Kennedy and uh, former President Donald Trump in which the former president appeared to endorse false theories about the safety of vaccines. Kennedy III deleted a post containing the video hours later. And all vaccines that are approved or authorized for use in the United States have been proven safe and effective through rigorous scientific uh, study. 90 giant African snails were confiscated by the U.S. Customs and Border Protection at the Detroit Metropolitan Airport late last month, as the agency said in a news release. An odd odor coming from the passengers, a bag tipped of agricultural specialists, as officials also said in the release. Uh, and just to note that a French soldier deployed in the country's anti-terrorism force was stabbed at a train station in central Paris. On Monday evening, French government officials also say a little more than a week before the Paris 2024 Olympics opening ceremony is due to take place. In sports, Gareth Southgate has announced that he will leave his role as the manager of the England men's national team. His decision comes two days after England's 2-1 defeat by Spain in the Euro 2024 final in Berlin. It is without sports note that we end this edition of the news on Cam 1 Radio, the People's Radio. The frequency is 99.5 FM and for presentation, I was a comment, Charles Sabanis. See you tomorrow, same time, same place on this network. Globus Education Systems provides affordable education for all. Scholarship and work programs in Poland are fully funded with free accommodation. A three-year employment visa with working hours from Monday to Friday and study hours on Saturday and Sundays. Eligibility to apply for permanent residency after five years can also be done in due time. The duration of the process lasts from three to six months max. Available educational programs include healthcare programs such as occupational health and safety technician, medical sterilization technician, medical caregiver, massage technician and occupational therapist the program also provides room for people with technical skills such as programmer technician automation technician it specialist electromechanic technicians in devices and systems for renewable energy engineering programs are meant for master students only and three specialties are involved